Hey guys, I'm giving y'all two videos in one day. I know y'all watch Love and Marriage Huntsville and Martel Holt's side chick finally speaks out. Let's get into this tape, baby. So from the jump, whenever this show started, we had this power couple, Melody and Martel Holt. They were a fan fave. And then all of a sudden, all this drama came out. Like They started off the show with drama. And so I'm always curious to know, was this all planted or staged? So the side chick finally speaks out. And so I'm going to reveal some of her receipts. The season just ended and I'm pretty sure Miss Arian is frustrated. Martel had the nerve to call her a peasant, but she wasn't a peasant when you was in her bed. He is so narcissistic and I am never for the downfall of a marriage, but girl, he like Melody can go out and find any man that she want, but they are a power couple, but she can do better because he treats her like trash. Like you've been having an affair with your wife for basically your whole marriage. Like you're that's sick. So Ariane sent this to Melody. She said, I'm going to reach out to you every time your husband tries to contact me from here on. Yesterday morning, your husband came to my house trying to bloop, 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 you fill in the blank, and get me to unblock him. He's gone on the road as of now. He stopped by in the morning before he left. I told him I was done with him, especially after last weekend when he literally was eating my kitty cat on Friday and out eating corn with you on Saturday. That is disgusting. You are pregnant period poo. I'm tired of this one minute he lying about a divorce. The next he on some BS. It's not me. Control Martel. He lies in, lies and lies. Keep him from reaching out to me, period. I know you called me not because of that picture. You knew deep down the night before he was at my house. You could have asked me, I would have told you. Maybe if I keep reaching out to you, he will stay out of my life. Control him. Baby, she said, control your man, Melody. The couple is expecting their fourth baby together, and it is another little girl. And I just hope that, you know, she already has daughters and she has one son, that she doesn't keep putting up with this because then you're teaching your kids to deal with this type of abuse. He may not be physically hitting her, but all this emotional trauma is not good and it's not good for the babies because then they'll keep this generational curse going no amount of money is worth losing your soul in dealing with the humiliation of this narcissist like he wants his cake and eat it too and i don't know well you know what let's just get into the next set of receipts here for the next set of receipts and this is the last that i got a buddy still good so i'm gonna read it because it's super tiny. I'm so tired of this narcissistic man. You can say whatever. Everybody knows you're a liar. That was the first thing your wife told me about you over four years ago. And you're right. You haven't contacted the peasant, whoever that is. But you continue to persistently contact Arion. And now it's going on five years. This was just Tuesday, the day before yesterday. And one thing about me is I will have a receipt to back up anything I say. Facts. I ain't got to lie. I'm not the one who sat down with Carlos King and paid him $400 for consultation to get on TV. I've never wanted to be famous. If y'all, Mr. I love my wife on TV, but Arion, please don't leave me. I will take care of you. Just give me a couple of weeks. Please, Arion. Now, do you really want to do this? Sister's tired of her name being drugged. But in the end, you knew he was married. Like, I see both sides. Like, you are a home record because he was married and you were still sleeping with him and you knew it. Um, But, again, I was rooting for them. I was rooting for Melody and Martel. But baby Martel can't get it together. So, I'm going to need my good sis Melody to go ahead and chunk up the deuce. Like, I'm all here for commitment. And when you go before God, you say you're going to deal with a lot of stuff. But, baby, he's not willing to change. Or he changes for a little bit. That is not enough. Okay, guys. So, I'm done off my little rant. Comment down below if you think Melody needs to go ahead and file for the divorce and move on. And also... 
if you would like a video of Kiowa, Maurice, and Kimmy, go ahead. Because that's a lot of tea right there, too. Go ahead and comment down below on that. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys.